there is, Jimmy. Just like Mobius said. Easy money. I don't know. There's a lot of Protoss down there. We're gonna have to... What the? Warning. Multiple Zerg biosignatures detected. Ah, oh, hell. Them critters were just hiding on the ground, waiting? No idea, but you can bet they're headed straight for our shrine. Well, that show complicates things. We can't fight two armies at once, partner. With any luck, we won't have to. We only need to hold the area at the top of the shrine long enough to extract the artifact. So we'll land here and cut our way through the Protoss lines while they're busy with the Zerg. It's only a matter of time before the Zerg overwhelm the Protoss. We'd best grab the artifact and be long gone by then. The Zerg severely outnumber the Protoss forces. It is likely the Protoss will fall shortly. Well, here's the plan. Then we've got to get that artifact before the Zerg overrun the whole place. SCV ready! Protoss stalkers are gathering at our perimeter. What's so? up? Incoming transmission. I got something new for you, cowboy. Marauders, the latest word in Big Bada Boom hardware. I ain't sure this is the best time to be experimenting, Swan. Best time there is. Let the marauders loose against those stalkers and you'll see. Armed and ready. This better be. Say the word, baby. You gonna give me orders? SCV ready! The doctor is in. Affirmative. Bad news?
I'm in a world of hurt! Ah! You scared me! Morning. Incoming Zerg attack wave detected. Can't wait. Outstanding. This better be good. By the numbers, boys. Bad news. Not enough add-on complete. Not enough minerals. Leave me hanging. minerals. Got it. 
Not enough minerals. You gonna give me orders? Orders received. Not enough minerals. Additional supply depots required. Big job, huh? Sure thing. Who wants some? Additional supply depots required. Hanging. under attack. Additional supply to It's about to minerals. get heavy. Bad news. I'm on it. Got it. Additional supply depots required. Can't wait. That's fine. Roger that. Oh yeah. By the numbers, boys. You gonna give me orders?
Sure. That's fine. Shirt on, Sparky. Base is under attack. Job, huh? It's your dime. Armed and ready. Ten Roger that. Got a crew coming down to pick up the artifact. We got what we came for. Let's hightail it out of here. I forgot how resourceful you were, Jim. I won't make that mistake twice. Kerrigan. Funny, convict. I don't recall giving you access to our database. Just keeping up on current events, Captain. Seems this Queen of Blades got everybody running scared. <laughs> she don't look so tough. You have no idea who she is, do you, Tychus? Don't matter to me, none. Well, it matters to Jim. They were... close once. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're telling me they were shacked up? Apparently she was something else. Before the Zerg took her. Turned her into that. And Jimmy feels responsible. Honestly, if we have to face her again, I don't know what he'll do. Woman like that, there's only one thing to do.
I caught Tychus hacking into our database, sniffing around about Kerrigan. I don't know what his game is, but we clearly can't trust him. Matt, me and Tychus ran together a long time. Got in all sorts of trouble. When the law finally caught up, he took the rap for both of us. Never once ratted me out. I got a second chance. He got locked up. I understand your loyalty, sir, but... I owe him, Matt. Leave it be. Yes, sir. Your Mobius buddies ever happen to mention that the Queen of Blades wants these artifacts too? Hey, they just give me the missions, man. What's it matter anyway? Putting that bitch down would be doing everyone a favor. I thought it was just about the money with you, Tychus. Nothing says I can't do my part for humanity and get paid well for my trouble. Right. This is Donnie Vermillion live from UNN. Tonight, we're going to discuss the infamous Queen of Blades. Scientists and military insiders have long speculated that the enigmatic alien is in fact an infested human. That's right, Donnie. Is it possible that the leader of the Zerg has a human heart? More importantly, Kate, could this mean some kind of Terran-Zerg alliance is possible? Donnie, there's never been any evidence, at all, to suggest that infested humans retain their free will. You make a good point, Kate. The question is, then, how do we kill her? That's one I think we all can agree on. If humanity is to survive, the Queen of Blades needs to be eliminated. Commander. The alien artifact is all secure in the lab, sir. You know, seeing it got me to thinking about my special projects. Whoa, slow down, Stedman. What do you mean, projects? You doing some kind of research down here? Yeah, well, you know, not yet, sir. I still need some additional specimens to get things going. Once I get those, we can make some big improvements to our weapon systems and tactics. Well, I'm all for that. What do you need? All kinds of things. I've entered the details into our database. If you run into something on a mission that we need, you'll be notified automatically. Just try not to blow up the ship. Okay, Stedman? That Zerg woman seemed to know you. She really rattled you, didn't she? Me and her, well, we go back a ways. She was a ghost once. Back then, we were hooked up with Manx and fighting to get rid of the old Confederacy. Made a pretty good team. What happened to her? She was a casualty of war. No offense, Doc. But I really don't like to talk about it. I understand. If you ever change your mind, I'm here. I've been hearing strange stories from the crew of late. Unexplained noises, strange visions, voices in the dark. Rumor has it these things are haunted. Superstitious nonsense. These artifacts are completely inert and they're contained down here in the lab. There is some trace radiation, but I don't see how they could affect things elsewhere on the ship. Heaven forbid we run across alien tech that messes with our primitive little monkey brains. Just keep a close eye on them, Doc. 
Sir, confronting Kerrigan again after all these years. We've got to stop her, Matt. No matter what she's after. Well, we gave her a setback today. The artifacts are obviously important to her. I just wish we knew why. I hear the mighty Jim Rayner's on the move, but short on funds. The planet Redstone's got the most valuable minerals around. And with the Zerg invasion, the Kilmorians backed up and left it all behind. Some enterprising men could turn a big profit there. Meet me at Redstone if you want a piece of the action. <laughs> <laughs> 